Excellency, Head of Delegates, Ladies and Gentlemen. First of all, I would like to con congratulate the Government of the United Kingdom, the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, as well as UNFPA, for organizing this very important forum. Further, I would like to introduce the word Gotong Royong. Gotong Royong, which is popular in Indonesia. It means the sharing of all communities' responsibilities. In Indonesia, it has been a powerful force driving our effort since the 60s. <clears throat> We realize that <clears throat> Indonesia's fertility rate of 5.6 births per woman was not sustainable. We knew the strain of families and public services would eventually cripple our country. So, from Gotong Royong program, we came to a successful family planning national movement. Build smaller families and increasing access to contraception and reproductive health services. This along with community education and economic opportunities for our people, help to reduce the fertility rate to just 2.3 births per woman, averting 100 million births. There were four key steps <clears throat> to accomplish the challenges. Firstly, <clears throat> we empowered local community participation to reach rural areas in the 70s. We recruited as many as 40,000 field workers and more than 100,000 volunteers to bring reproductive health services to the village level. Secondly, we launched an innovative communication mass campaign designed to bring about change in social norms. It was called the Small, Happy, and Prosperous Family Campaign. Thirdly, we focus on creating public-private partnerships. And fourthly, we focus on the quality of service. Excellency, ladies and gentlemen, from 5.6 to 2.3 births per a woman in over 30 years. This to be a great success. Several factors were identified as keys to success. The first was political will and political commitment, including funding and other resources. Second, establishing a national Family Planning Coordinating Board. Third, the board has benefited effective management from national level to the district level. Fourth, we developed data and reporting system and built research capacity. And, last, and lastly, strengthened collaboration of a broad spectrum of stakeholders. Currently, we are also developing the grand design of population development that consists of population growth control, increasing quality of human resources, development of prosperous small family, population distribution management, and development of population single identity. Delegates, head of delegates, 
ladies and gentlemen. We are extremely proud of how family planning has helped individuals, families, and our country. But we still face challenges and we are committed to addressing them. We are elevating the quality of family planning, committing to improve approximately 23,500 family planning clinics from the year 2010 to 2014. We are increasing mobile family planning services in remote areas. And we are committed to reducing the disparities in contraceptive usage by providing free contraceptives in seven out of 33 provinces. We are addressing financial barriers by initiating a health insurance for the poor. We are improving access by integrating family planning into childbirth insurance scheme which launched in 2011. This program introduced free antenatal care, delivery, postnatal care, as well as postpartum family planning. And as a G20 member, we also have a responsibility to share our experience and lesson learned to our counterparts in the developing world. We have learned a lot and we have a lot to share. So today we are pleased to announce first that we will include family planning within universal health insurance program that will begin in January 2014. Second, we increase our human resource investment through our international training program, ITP, so that other countries can visit Indonesia and learn our experience. This is a major commitment of ours toward South-South cooperation. Third, Increase finance for family planning program since 2006. Fourth, increase methods of long acting and permanent. Fifth, highlight upcoming global youth forum. Finally, successful family planning movement means bright future for young generation and the country. I wish we can share ideas and draw inspiration from each other. And at least I'd, I would like to invite all of you to see family planning program in our country, in my country, Indonesia. Especially I would like to invite Mrs. Melina Gates to see the program as well. I thank you.